first thing, because I remember it was the first day when we met, we were walking in the trailer and and Katie's wearing this awesome onesie, you know, just hanging <laughs> nice. out in the trailer. I'm like, that is, that I think I commented on, I'm like, I, I love your outfit. <laughs> yeah. Like, first thing in the morning, this breath of fresh air. She's comfortable, but she's stylish at the same time. So I'm like, all right. This place is incredible. There's work to be done. Welcome to the coolest castle in the world, where the most eligible prince. Delighted. Hey guys, you want a date? No, it's not a date. He's in for the ride of his life. <laughs> You don't know how to open a bottle of wine. Absolutely true. Yeah. A royal Christmas crush. Only on Hallmark. Where love happens. Hello? Hi. Hello. Here you go. You guys are you? Third. makes it easier. One screen. Yeah, right? exactly. <laughs> how you doing, buddy? I'm doing well. How are you guys? Great, thanks. Good, thank you. Where in the world are you at currently? Uh, we are in Los Angeles. Oh, there you go. Kitty, I, I follow you on Facebook. So I saw you were like in Lake Tahoe. You were all over the place. So I'm just wondering yeah. if you're still on a vacation or whatnot. Oh, uh, no, we actually we went to go visit one of our mutual friends in Lake Tahoe, which was amazing. Oh, yeah. But yes, we've done certainly a lot of traveling. I'm ready to, to stay home for a second. <laughs> just a second. It's a good thing in that case, you know. At least you're making use of summer too, so that's that's fun too. Exactly, and there's a writer strike, so what better? Yeah, do? travel, see the world. Maybe, Maybe. an actor strike. I mean, uh, striking Maybe. everywhere. I yeah. know. Yeah. Well, at least you guys got the movie in, so we can talk about yeah, exactly that. right. Yeah, and we got yeah. Christmas in July. So. <laughs> well, you know what? Isn't it the, like the halfway point of Christmas, just like right about now, or, or like a week or two ago? I think it's like. Yeah, I think so. I think Hallmark timed it that way. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> They're just too excited. Yeah. I mean, it, it was kind of, it was an experience watching a Christmas movie in July, you know, but it was a, it, it was, it felt comfortable and nice, you know, to see snow. I'm from Chicago, so I'm used to the, the cold when it comes to winter, but uh, it, it's right. a, it's a fun time of year to give you like, uh, you know, a six month heads up on, on uh, Christmas time. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Absolutely. Hundred percent. Who doesn't love Christmas? Especially you know the poor people, uh, the kids who have their birthdays so close to Christmas, right? You know. Yeah. Because, you know, and now it's like you can celebrate Christmas. You mean like me? Like, November twenty fifth. Well, it's January twenty fourth. Uh, okay, yeah, so we're both similar. Kind of we're kind of within that month, you know. So. Yeah, right after the festivities, or right, right after, after, you know. Yeah. yeah, everyone's over it well, by exactly. the time we get to his birthday. Yeah. <laughs> Katie, I, I don't want to expose Steve, um, Steven here, but um, he's dated Trish Stratus last Christmas. Every Christmas I see he's in a relationship with someone. So, I mean, if I had a dime for every time he, he's in a new relationship come Christmas, I'd be a millionaire probably. And I can vouch. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Are you my mother can vouch for this. Uh, okay? uh, all star. No, no, he's talking about how my co-stars survive all these these uh, these co-stars that are that are that are Christmassy. Oh, yeah. Yes. Yeah, yes. You, you've worn multiple hats, you know what I mean, too. So you, you've been helping out in the mountains. You were a, a restaurant owner at one point, yeah. a bodyguard. Right. You do um, whatever it takes, Steven. I'm a lumberjack. I do what all it takes, and now Prince, finally. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> right. It was a natural connection, after all. You know? Yeah, exactly. Might as well throw me to the wolves and, well, not the wolves. Throw me throw me to a very beautiful and talented architect. We'll That's see what right. I also the wolves. Also the wolves. <laughs> You're doing well is what I'm trying to say. You know, so if I had an ounce of that luck, I'd probably be married with kids right now. But clearly I'm not. <laughs> an ounce. That's all it takes. <laughs> I guess so, too. This was Hilarious. fun. First of all, I'm curious about this ice hotel. Is this an mm. elaborate set? Like, this looked cool. So I don't know. Hopefully it wasn't like in the middle of summer. But I don't know. Movie oh, next. no. It was definitely in the middle of Canada. And it was very cold. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. um it was a real ice hotel that was it, it's actually really cool because they it have was these, okay they sculpt they have these sculptors come in and sculpt do yeah. their artwork for like all over the walls and then every at the end of uh winter obviously it, it melts away and they do it again yeah yeah and so it was starting to melt on us i'm just glad we got through. yeah it didn't, didn't, didn't melt and drip away while we were there luckily but they just closed the hotel just just the day before we started shooting that man so that was like actually created like a engineered the design of this whole thing oh yeah yeah, yeah. 
That's amazing. What it was yeah. like in there? Would you guys kind of like have a Amazing. crap moment like this is an igloo that's like living basically yeah it totally. was really cool it does feel like a different world it certainly, yeah, certainly does totally. yeah you're going in there and the temperature drops and we all just want to you know get the take so we can go out and warm up under the sun yeah, yeah. No. especially since it needs to be cold right <laughs> it's gonna melt exactly. away literally yeah <laughs> totally <laughs> well that's then one of the coolest sets I, I think i've seen uh in that case on film that's actually real uh, you know not not fabricated in a way where it's like oh no it's all plastic or whatever you imagine yeah. it was just like dead, uh, it, dead it, summer yeah. yeah we were shooting in a fake ice hotel yeah no, no. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, this is I'd one of the sweating. this is one of the few Christmas movies I've shot where it's actually real, really hot. I mean, sorry, really cold. No, we're uh -huh. not shooting. Anything. So normally, it's you know, you shoot and then you got to take off your layers and have fans blowing on you. This is the other way around. We actually put layers on us oh, after yeah. our, after our takes this time. That's that's cool. Uh, and literally, I literally, no pun intended. Yeah. <laughs> no acting required. That it was. Yeah, cold. exactly. So what's the extent of you guys knowing each other? Have you known each other throughout the years or kind of finally got together in a movie or, or the movie sprung this all up? So how sort of were you guys dating back to, to knowledge of, you, of each other? We met wow. on the film. First day. Yeah, okay. and wow. it yeah. was very refreshing because we didn't know, he didn't know who I was. I didn't know who he was. Didn't do our research. You, know, you didn't just... see Arrow ever or anything like that. No, I know I should have. I'm watching it now, though. <laughs> <laughs> um, just watching the episode Katie directed, actually. Yeah. Fantastic. Thank yeah. You. Anyway, watch Arrow if you haven't. Heard there you go. Yeah, it's out there. <laughs> um, so yeah, it was all very organic, and we got to know each other and kept it professional as yeah you know, as we do and. Yeah, here yeah. we are. It just kind of all happened. Yeah. So, you know, when you just, you can't really plan chemistry, I guess. Uh huh. Um, our characters, sure, you know, I think we we had chemistry during the show, our characters, and, you know, it just sort of leaked over to the other side yeah. of the other line. Wow. <laughs> Look at that. Did this Hallmark get a thanks for this potentially? <laughs> well, we'll tomorrow, like, we're so going to go stop it. by and see them tomorrow. So maybe we will bring them a little something like thanks, guys. Yeah. Yeah. That's Thank pretty cool. You know, it's kind of reassuring in a sense, being a watcher of films like that, uh, that you know what real stuff does happen, you know, out of this stuff. So it's not all just script and storylines. Actual truth sometimes lies in the work. Yeah, True. absolutely. Truly. Yeah. Although this is this is the first co-star I've ever dated. So yeah. <laughs> well, it took um, a prince, right? I mean, Katie. Right? Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, but yeah it's a happy surprise yes. definitely that's cool now i'm guessing like do we have like sequels out of this potentially yeah, there's a universe it. everyone's got a multiple right? royal christmas honeymoon royal christmas wedding yeah. royal christmas baby i mean we got <laughs> also like let's go tropical yeah right because uh, uh bahamas perhaps yes ice hotel may be melted by now you know so very very possible yes so true yeah Oh, that's fantastic. Or exotic, at least, right? We, we should, uh, we'll talk to them about my friend John's hotel in Hawaii. In Hawaii. Yeah, that's a great idea. When we go there tomorrow. I like this idea. Yeah. Okay. There you yeah. go. You see, we don't need to, like I said, you guys proven with this film, you don't need to, you know, technically be in the winter to, to make sparks fly, you know, as long as. Right, exactly. <laughs> whatever it releases, it's a good thing, you know? Yeah, and yeah. I love a beach, so. <laughs> We do love beaches. Yes. There you go. Not a bad thing at all. You know, especially being in that cold, uh, you know, structure there, hotel, a nice beach would, would sound pretty nice at this point. Yeah. Oh, right? yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Bring it on. <laughs> is it is it extra fun to play a, pr a prince? I had always imagined that'd be kind of a fun role to do, you know, uh, yeah. play a it's royalty, right? Great. No, it's it's super fun stepping out of your you know your yeah. comfort zone something i'm used to and and uh, throwing on an accent and having a nice top suit and, yeah you're starting to get really know. comfortable getting catered being catered and too. also <laughs> yeah. people treat you really well um katie made a point of earlier on in the show actually i think it was the first day to get on the uh getting the shortwave radio, radio connected to all the crew and said well from now on we are no longer going to be addressing Stephen as Stephen. We may only uh, be calling him Prince Henry, and we all must speak in a British accent from here on out. Thank you very much. 
please no no calling Stephen by his real name no no and that 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 actually happened through the whole set and I think perhaps uh people are still stuck talking because yeah. right they got really good at it it was fun it was definitely yeah. fun yeah it was super fun well yeah we finally got it got done with him you know him and his yeah. demanding prince ways right yeah hilarious right. exactly <laughs> let's go so was that your idea Stephen, to, to do the accent uh or was this kind of in a script or whatnot um yeah well originally i was preparing it i mean friorland is sort of a place somewhere in very cold you know area uh -huh. it's obviously a fictitious place um, i was thinking so, like iceland or something somewhere yeah, no, some norse some norwegian yeah. so originally that was the plan and i was preparing that accent and then i, I had a had a conversation with our director about a week or so a week and a half before and she's like no we've decided to go british people will get it more it's <laughs> easier to it's, it's definitely the the north norwegian accent's a lot harder as well so and i think we just wanted to keep it consistent so that's why we decided to go with that instead but uh, okay. certainly it required some sort of accent. Yeah. We're not yeah, no, I think it worked. <laughs> totally. you, think, you always think of royalty sort of, you know, not very Americanized or whatnot, right. you know? Right. <laughs> like if you had a Southern accent, I probably wouldn't believe it as much. <laughs> Hilarious. <laughs> yeah, maybe that's for the next one. Yeah. <laughs> do you have any <laughs> architecture know. background or anything? You made it look pretty legitimate, like actually know this stuff. <laughs> Um, well, I definitely um, love design and I definitely, hmm. you know, paint, draw, sketch. Uh, so there's definitely, yeah, I mean, I love, especially when it comes to um, interior design or, yeah, I love architecture. It's, it's another like creative, I guess, outlook. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, I definitely also like looked into it. I got myself a sketch pad and like got all the tools that they use because I was trying to do, you know, some character work and and in fact when I was on set and I would be sketching away they were like uh continuity don't actually <laughs> sketch we know you're an architect but can you just like not do that can you just I was like, <laughs> robbing me of my oh, yeah. craft yes. mm -hmm. um so yeah there's definitely a genuine interest there for sure yeah, they probably ruined the second chance for another hotel, you know, like <laughs> they're getting in your way of it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Uh, what do you guys want to do next? Do you want to work together now that you had this experience together? I'm I'm guessing it's <laughs> turned out Never. well. So no, that'd be horrible. No. No. <laughs> Terrible actor. My oh, gosh, we want to work stop. opposite this. Yeah, it's so disgusting difficult. being. Yes. <laughs> um, no, we would, I mean, I would love to work with him, uh, whether it be this or something else. I mean, he's he's obviously. I'm very fond of him. Hmm. Um, so yeah. I think <laughs> Great if we, you know, whether it be this or something else. Uh, I've been directing and um, obviously I have another, I, acting as I do, I have another film coming out um, called Bunker at the end of the year. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a suspense thriller movie and I have a short that I wrote, I wrote and directed that I'm going to release around the election. Um, called America's Next Best President, which will come out in 2024. Is that sort of a, a hint there on the shirt? Well, yeah, you know, you got to go with it. It's all about, it's a spoof on American politics. So I'm go. definitely going to, yeah, it's fun. Mm -hmm. Have you been interested in politics or just something over the years you kind of got more passionate about? Uh, I've always been interested in politics. I lived in Canada for a while when I was shooting Arrow. So, I, you know, you don't know, I don't always follow, um, but and especially when I was there living in Star Lake City and, you know, on this fake world. But uh, no, definitely I've been interested in politics. I did a pilot probably 15 years ago. That was uh, 10 years ago. I don't know. Called uh, Georgetown. And it was about sort of, you know, the younger up and coming um, uh, inner circle of, of the White House when Obama was uh, mm -hmm. in office. Mm -hmm. And so I got to do a lot of, I had this, researcher do this I had this like huge book that I studied and I so I learned a lot about politics so mm -hmm. yes mm -hmm. to long long answer of your question yes I've been in full circle <laughs> yes exactly <laughs> if you need any Canadian policies or something Stephen's a good source yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah exactly. that's, that's true. I'll stay out of American politics I can <laughs> talk a little bit of the parliamentary system if you'd like to know a little bit about that yeah <laughs> there you go See, so you got that international source right there too. Yeah, yeah exactly. I'm here's I'm curious about this. Great chemistry on screen, clearly off screen. 
what is a favorite thing about each other? Maybe what attracted you to each other? I'm going to start with you, Stephen. What's the one? <laughs> I'm sure there's a multiple things, even there's though a lot. it's yeah, so hard a... to stress it about Katie, you know, all the great things about her. I know. It's um, just like, what, what, what things can I, I count on? I don't know. What do you think uh, of when you think of her? What are the first things? Well, that come to mind? I mean, the first, the, honestly, the first thing, because I remember it was the first day when we met, we were walking the trailer and and Katie's wearing this awesome onesie, you know, just hanging out <laughs> nice. in the trailer. I'm like, that is, that I think I commented on, I'm like, I, I love your outfit. <laughs> yeah. It's like, first thing in the morning, this breath of fresh air, she's comfortable, but she's stylish at the same time. So I'm like, all right, that's pretty cool. Um, yeah. A lot of other things as well, but that was the first thing that struck me, yeah, just wow. for fashion. Okay, you make an well, impression, also, Katie. I think that it kind of goes in a similar way because for me, he, so I love crystals and I'm very spiritual and mm -hmm. but I didn't learn this until after I started to get to know him but you had tiger's eye he was wearing crystal uh bracelets tiger's eye and so I was like oh yeah. oh and you were wearing lots of crystals a lot well. of crystals I don't have them on at this very moment but I normally am drowning in them yes. um <laughs> and that it. sort of caught my attention and then he's just on a Let's pretend like he's not here for a second. Yes, yes, he's not here. He left. Exit left. Such a beautiful heart and a genuine, lovely human being, like mm. the greatest I've ever met. No. So, um, yeah, all of that. Yeah, it's when you when you when you start getting to know someone, and then you realize you're kind of looking at yourself at the same time. There's this there's this familiarity and this 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 connection that you have that's um, it, it doesn't happen. Yeah. ever really so once that happens and it's it's a pretty special thing yeah. so yeah. i'm taking tips as a single guy swiping away i'm literally Hilarious. <laughs> yes. swiping away <laughs> it's unsuccessfully mind you too so Hilarious. it's good to see uh oh, that'll turn yeah. around that'll turn yeah. around yeah yeah, you know what? You got to have hope, you know? And sometimes, like they yeah. say, it happens on the most unexpected ways, right? And then unlikely as well, so. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, you guys are living proof of that, too. So that that's fantastic. I love that. And and speaking of kind of crystals, I, I just off topic quickly, I had a couple hours ago, I did a, I had an astrology reading. I did an interview and I had an astrology reading. It was phenomenal. Okay. Like, oh, that's oh, yeah. awesome. <laughs> yeah, I learned so much about astrology and signs and symbols and what my legacy is going to be or meant to be. That's awesome. Yeah. Good for Fascinating you. stuff. Yeah. No, apparently I'm best suited as an actor. So, um, you know, new oh. stuff. Well, there you go. Well, you got a career. There you go. Even if you retire from the genre, maybe down huh? the road, I can be like a, a light Your version replacement? of replacement. <laughs> if I retire from the genre, I love that. Hilarious. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Sure, stunt double, whatever you want, or just yeah, like, whatever. Like, Maybe I'll look into like a Katie out there, another Katie or something yeah. on a set, you know. So yeah, totally. <laughs> See, love is in the air. Walmart, yeah, Walmart makes Walmart. it happen. Hey, this yeah. is yeah. now. They've this is together. their slogan. This is their slogan. Love happens, you know. Love uh, happens. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, yeah. I'm excited to see what's next for you guys. Uh, individually and together um Thanks. before i leave any sort of do you guys have any hobbies that you do together too that you kind of recognize things that you like to do on your free time when you're not on set well like to travel work out. <laughs> and work great out. idea yeah yeah, yeah, yeah we so. like to travel we like to work out um it's like meditate we do new things explore yeah learn we like to learn love learning love learning um, there, mm -hmm. there's a lot that we, we we like playing with cats dancing with cats oh, yeah we had a little dance off oh yeah cats? how many cats do you guys have uh two cats and a dog okay uh, <laughs> so yeah we had a little dance party with the animals when we got back from tahoe last night it's very cute mm -hmm. yeah that sounds like a fun life, you know, oh, yeah. <laughs> maybe a reality show hack with all that's going on with you guys, you know, maybe they'll bring the cameras uh, around yeah. your travel. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, right. My cats need their own reality show. Yeah, that's for do. sure. Oh, they certainly <laughs> Animals are literally the biggest personalities. You know, you'll always find that ab about them. So oh, for sure. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, this was so much fun catching up with you, Katie, too. Last time I talked to you was, um, on Danny A's, uh, my guy Danny A. Ah, uh, uh, yeah. yeah, I love us, love you know. So, uh, yes, yeah, he's great. He's amazing. 
Oh yeah. Great guy. Uh, good to see you doing well. And, uh, Steven, welcome to the family, I guess, or the club. You Thanks, know? Man. Yeah. I <laughs> Thank feel, you. I feel very welcome. Thank you. You yeah. know, bad news for your future dates, your holiday dates on right. the next Hallmark movie. You know what I mean? So I know, I'm gonna, sorry guys. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Katie. Hey, yeah. don't be sorry. He's done plenty of dating over the years yeah. okay, on <laughs> Christmas time. So he's he's got a lifetime's worth. So yeah, awesome. Yeah. All right. I hope to catch up with you guys on whatever's next uh, on Project awesome. Wise. And I'm yeah, sure there's going to be a Hallmark movie on the horizon. Yes. Absolutely. Awesome. Well, care. thank you so much. So good Thanks to see you. Thanks for your time, here. buddy. Yes, you too. Definitely. Good to see you guys. Happy. Thank yeah. you. Bye. Bye-bye.